John badly injured his hand while threatening in to retrieve the pipe from the pipe cutting machine. Clearly, he is to be blamed and disciplined. Do you agree? My name is Marcin Nazarek, and I have the privilege of leading human performance in BP's upstream organization. By background, I am a chartered psychologist and a chartered safety professional. Every major breakthrough in human history, whether technological, political, or scientific, started with one thing, a new way of thinking. So how can we think differently about John's accident? People's actions are rarely malicious and usually make sense to them at the time. The mistakes that people make are typically due to underlying conditions and systems. Understanding why these mistakes happen can help us to prevent them. Our understanding of incident causation is fundamental to our ability to learn from accidents. For example, we could think that there is a single root cause of incidents which if tackled, will fix the problem. In fact, incidents are the result of complex interactions between people, plant and processes. Equipment and activities can be designed to reduce mistakes and manage risk better. It matters how leaders respond when things go wrong. If they welcome bad news and recognize the speak-up behaviors, workers are more likely to point out the weak signals allowing managers to address them in time. Our in-house research showed that trust towards management even predicted process safety events. Imagine a team investigating John's incident and applying this new way of thinking. What would they find? Reaching into the machine made sense to John. He was a newly trained employee and was taught it was the quickest way. The machine used on the shop floor was slightly different to the one used in training and did not have an automatic switch-off sensor. That was because the procurement process did not include it in their specification. Do you still think John is to blame? What you look for is what you find. Our mental model of how accidents happen directly impacts our findings. So, why can this innovation, this new way of thinking about behavior improve sustainability in our industry. Because the more aligned we are with the facts about behavior developed by science, the more effective we will be in achieving our goals in a safe manner. And through this, we'll improve the image of our industry in the eyes of the public and global society.